Welcome ladies and gentlemen, my name is David Oliveira and you're watching Netcat Sports and we have another special guest here. We have the president of the Basketball League, Mr. David Magley. Mr. Magley, we appreciate your time. Can you tell us a little bit about the league and what you're trying to do here in the Raleigh Triangle area? David, we're, 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 we're actually a second year league. Uh, the league started last year, it was called the NAPBL, the North American Premier Basketball League. And it just seemed to be a little bit too many uh, syllables and, and acronyms. So we shortened it, made it simpler to the TBL. We hired a new uh, 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 CEO and a new owner uh, to go along with myself, and her name is Evelyn Magley. And she, besides being the most beautiful woman in the world, uh, and my wife, she really provides a new direction for the league. She's got a, got a passion for community. So what we want to do is we want to create a community team, a community league that's based on professional basketball, that's like a double-A baseball level. We respect the NBA and their, and their development league, the G League, but we, there's so many markets that, that, that can host us and so much talent. And that's what we're looking for today is the talent. Giving young men a chance to be professional basketball players, be, beyond that take, that, take that talent and push it down to the community, into the schools, into the youth, and tell kids about the dangers of drugs and alcohol, the, 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 the value of an education, uh, what, what happens with anti-bullying or self-worth or how to defend yourself in a bullying scenario, we can deliver messages we think as good as better than the parents and the teachers because we're different. They turn off the parents, they turn off the teachers, but here come these young guys that have been someplace, played college, they're pro athletes, and they're saying, you're so important, we'll come to the school to talk to you. We'll come to the school to tell you, you need to feel good about yourself. You need to be the one that looks at that person that's eating by themselves in the lunchroom and, 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 and identifies that they need to be encouraged. And we can deliver those messages and we think it's important. And that's what we're hoping we can do on the community side of what we're trying to accomplish. So coach, basketball is one thing, but it sounds like the community involvement is the biggest thing for you guys. Are there any specific programs that the Raleigh Firebirds will be working on? It's a great point. The Raleigh Firebirds have identified some educational programs, so STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math. And, and by doing that, they're working with, with some very specific private entities as well as the schools to encourage youth to be able to get those educations and how we, how we leverage those educations to the next level. My, one of my youngest, my youngest son of my four kids has a college degree in business from a very good school. But getting the right job's hard. He's going back right now to get a, to get a, a degree in, in coding, a three month program that promises him a great job when he's done. These are important. If your mind can get around where the jobs are, and, and it is in science, technology, and engineering, and math, if we can encourage these young people, we're going to change the trajectory of their lives because they can go out and be productive. And again, we help them deliver that. Ladies and gentlemen, David Oliveira, Netcast Sports. We're here with the president of the Basketball League, David Magley.